Hey guys, I'm Christian, and I'm going to be coming to you with an initial stake pool offering meetup, all about what Cardano's doing and how people are utilizing the initial stake pool offerings to get their tokens distributed to the Cardano community. We'll go through the top seven projects right now. All seven of them have an initial stake pool offering and are distributing their tokens, and then a special eighth initial stake pool offering, which is going to happen here in a probably a few weeks and it's going to be the one that is the most desirable and I think the one that everybody's going to want to take advantage of. So let's dive right in. So first off, what is an initial stake pool offering? Basically what you do in Cardano is stake your tokens into a stake pool and Cardano um, stake pool operators get rewarded based on how many blocks that they place into the blockchain. Those rewards get distributed typically to the delegators who are putting their Cardano into that stake pool. And the rewards are usually somewhere between 4% and 6% on an annualized basis. So a good way to figure that is about a 5% return annualized. So if you were putting 100 tokens into a stake pool that was averaging 5% annually, you'd get five tokens at the end of the year. So you can break that up into a 12 month time frame if you want a monthly distribution or the epics that Cardano uses are five days long. So you can kind of break it into an epic distribution as well. But that gives you kind of an idea on how the stake pools typically work and how delegators get rewarded. With initial stake pool offerings, what decentralized applications are doing is creating stake pools or having other stake pool operators um, have delegations to them from people that want to earn those particular tokens as rewards. The biggest and probably the best one right now to go through is MELD, which started their initial stake pool offering back in July and really has done a great job at promoting it and getting over 600 million ADA delegated into their 10 stake pools. That's right, 600 million. So they have a lot of ADA that has been delegated. That equates to $1.2 billion worth of ADA they are going to be distributing 100 million MELD tokens to the participants and the, that have delegated ADA to those stake pools, those 10 MELD stake pools. And so there is a lot of rewards that are going to be distributed to the people who have participated in the stake pool offerings. Now, MELD offered two different kinds of stake pools. One is a 50-50, which you would get your 50% ADA rewards, your Cardano rewards, each epic, and 50% awarded in MELD awards. And then the other nine, I believe, are all 100% MELD awards. So all of your ADA rewards that you would be getting will go to MELD, and in return, they'll be providing you MELD tokens for those rewards that you would get. Now, you don't gain or lose any of the Cardano tokens that you delegate to their pool. So if you delegate 1,000 ADA tokens or 100 100,000 ADA tokens, you can withdraw them anytime you want, and you can use them any way you want. Meld doesn't have access to them. They stay in your wallet, which is the best part about staking with Cardano. Everything stays in your wallet. You delegate it to a specific stake pool operator to use for validation. And at the end of the epics, you get rewarded a certain amount of tokens. In this case, Meld has kept the tokens that would typically be rewarded, and now is going to be distributing Meld tokens. I believe the distribution date is going to be December 5th. Yeah, it's ending on, excuse me, December 8th. So it's ending on December 8th, and then the MELD tokens will be airdropped to all of the wallets that have staked to the MELD pool. It was very self-explanatory. They did a really good job of laying out how they're going to be distributing their tokens, how many tokens you'll be rewarded for each ADA staked and everything like that. And some of the other stake pools that are out there, it's a little bit more difficult to figure out exactly how they're going to be rewarding their tokens or what the value is of every single token. Um, and, and by that, I mean that some pools, it's uh, harder to figure out what they're valuing ADA at or what they're valuing their tokens at. So you can't really determine how many tokens you're going to get rewarded. 
Um, with Meld, it's very easy. It's 0.065 token per ADA that you stake. So you can kind of figure it out very easily. Every Epic, you'll be getting X amount of tokens. And then they had bonuses on top of how many tokens were delegated if you delegated them for a certain amount of time. So it was like 15 Epics is 10%. 20 epics was 20% and 25 epics was, you know, 30%. You'll get a, a bonus on top of whatever it is that you're earning. So a really cool way to distribute their tokens and also to, to build some community awareness and get a very big following for their project. Occam Phi, the um, second project that is doing an initial stake pool offering. Occam is one of the biggest DEXs that's rolling out on Cardano. It's backed by the C Fund, which is a um, subsidiary of the uh, Cardano Foundation, um, backed by some larger players in the Cardano ecosystem, Charles Hoskinson and Jeff Pollock. So um, Occam Phi is a launch pad and incubator and a decentralized exchange. Their stake pool that they're doing is a um, similar to what Meld's doing, and it, it basically lets you stake OCC tokens based on how much you delegate and for how long. Um, in this case, though, it's a little bit more difficult to figure out what their distribution is going to be. The Occam token is currently traded, and so it's um, traded right now on Uniswap and um, a couple of the small exchanges, Gate, IO. So their value as of this tape, and I believe is about $7.50. And it's uh, gonna be interesting to see how many Occam tokens actually get rewarded during their ISPO. So I guess on the Occam dashboard, you can see how many tokens are delegated, um, where they're delegated to, and uh, hopefully be able to get an idea on what the rewards are gonna look like. But Occam's another great place to delegate for those initial stake pool. Um, rewards. MinSwap, which you may have heard of, is another uh, decentralized exchange. They're having their initial stake pool offerings, but it is actually a small pool operator stake pool offering, in which case they partnered with 25 small stake pool operators and became more of a community event. Whereas Meld did all of their stake pools independently. They're all owned and operated by Meld as the, uh, the company behind it. MinSwap did uh, contacted or, or put out a uh, so, uh, request for proposal from uh, for their community to send them which stake pool operators they thought would really benefit from being staked in their initial stake pool offering. So they took the 25 stake pool operators, added them all into their list, and really offered something cool that the other people did, which is whichever stake pool had the least amount of tokens in it they give a 25 bonus to. So if you delegate to this just pool, which is the smallest one right now, not only will you get your rewards paid in min swap tokens, but you also get a 25% bonus on top of that because you're staking to the smallest one. Obviously that gives an incentive to the smallest guy to gain that delegation and grow from it. And then of course the next smallest guy would probably start getting more delegators and growing from that. And it increases the, the uh, state pool operators um, delegation accordingly so that there's not one state pool that gets 60 million in delegation, everybody else gets, you know, 500,000. This really levels the playing field, allows all the small stake pool operators to get a large delegation each. And then also too, from delegating into those small stake pools, you're also getting the min swap tokens in return. One of the nice things too, is that not only are you getting those min swap tokens, but there's no, um, you're also getting your ADA rewards. So your Cardano rewards and the min swap rewards are coming. So those pools are rewarding you for delegating to them. And you're also getting min swap tokens airdrop to you at the end of the initial stake pool offering as well. Great benefit. So you're not losing anything. You're basically just gaining from participating in the min swap ISBO. The uh, ADA lending, which is a, a lending protocol, and it is uh, doing their ISP right now as well. They're contributing to the uh, Cardano ecosystem. It's a smaller project, but they, again, they're distributing their ADA tokens and rewards accordingly, and their ISP is going fairly well. They've got their pools and their rewards. It's all listed on their Git book page right here, so you can read about it, and you can see how exactly how to participate. Um, at the end of this video, too, I'll show you 
my Euroya wallet and how easy it is to put your tokens directly into one of these initial stake pool offerings. Very simple, very easy, takes three clicks of a, of a mouse and you're good to go. Empawa, which is one of my favorite Cardano projects, is having their initial stake pool offering right now. I absolutely love what they're doing. And if you don't know what it is they're doing, please go to their website, take a look at them. They just had their NFT sale sell out, which creates this NFT with great functionality. You become a founding member of the Empower community. What they're attempting to do is build affordable housing in Africa, 4 million units over the next 10 years. And they're really a great um, environmentally friendly, community-driven project. They won the Catalyst Fund 6 for their proposal and are now um, creating value for the Cardano community, but also to allowing everyone to participate in what it is that they're doing. A really, really imaginative, really, um, I guess, feel-good project that allows all of the community to participate in their ISP um, and earn their Empower tokens. Their EMP tokens, but they're uh, also to one of the projects that's allowing you to get, um, you know, your 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 ADA staked, and then you can see exactly what it is that you're going to earn from it. Point oh oh three four amp per epic. So each time you stake an ADA, you'll know exactly what you're getting. And then they also too have a bonus, I believe, which depends on how long you stake your ADA for. They launched it on October fourth and. Not sure exactly when it's going to be ending here, but here's the two pools that you can stake to, um, and then you can calculate your rewards as well. But they're building a better future is what they're doing for a lot of families and communities inside of Africa, and it's just a, a really cool um, way to participate in the Cardano community and to hopefully add some credence to their project, give them some working capital and allow them to go out and execute on their mission. So a really great project there. Ray Network, uh, another DeFi project with a ton of different utilities that are going on inside of their roadmap. They've got a lot that's happening. They're a DEX, they're an NFT marketplace, they have a wallet, a swap. You know, there's all kinds of things that are happening inside of the Ray Network. You get the X-Ray token for participating in their ISPO. And they have a really cool um, ISPO as well where they do not take the... Um, I believe that they don't take the uh, the rewards that you get. So you get your ADA rewards. And on top of that, you get your X-ray tokens distributed to you. So another really cool project to take a look at. Last one on here is Mirkor, a DEX that's built on Cardano. It's got a roadmap. It's a smaller community-driven project that is um, really looking to be a DAO, as you can tell, you know, no BS their guiding principles. That's always good to know. They have their white paper that's posted right there, um, but they're they're really starting to, to uh, gain some traction and also to gain some tokens. And, you know, last project on here hasn't launched yet as far as initial stake pools go, but it is the one that is the highly anticipated, probably most sought after ISP that's going to launch here in the next couple of weeks. And that is Sunday Swap. The Sunday Swap has gotten a ton of attention. They've gotten attention from the founders of Cardano at the uh, Cardano Summit. They've been on Cardano 360 last month, and it's very highly anticipated. Their community is extremely large and growing every day. And if you're watching a lot of YouTubers and content creators out there, they're saying Sunday Swap is the next large DEX, a la Uniswap and other DEXs like that. They are going to launch their initial stake pool as soon as they launch their DEX, which is going to happen here probably within the next couple of weeks. They're getting audited right now. They're going through their final preparations for everything. And once they do, they're going to launch their initial stake pool. And how do we know that? Because they put out a request for proposal and application form for stake pool operators. They're going to be doing the same thing as MinSwap where they're going out and saying, all right, we don't wanna create our own pools. We want the community small stake pool operators to basically submit proposals to us. And then we'll find the ones that we like that we wanna partner with. And not only will they be stake pool operators, but they'll also get a chance to be um, pseudo validators for some of the um, behind the scenes, what's gonna be going on with Sunday Swap. They're gonna be creating their decks on a protocol that's gonna allow 
um, validation on some of the, uh, the swaps that happen and they're gonna need trusted sources for that. And that's gonna be a lot of their initial stake pool operators as well that are gonna be able to help with that. So Sunday swap, extremely highly anticipated is one of those projects that could you know jump up in value dramatically and they're allowing people to come in i believe it's going to be for five epics to stake with them and then to earn those sunday tokens which again everybody's looking forward to because it's a big project it's pretty much the marquee project right now on cardano so when we get down to it how quick and easy is it to stake well here's my meld wallet on your Roy. And you can see that I've delegated into the meld ISP05 delegation pool. So in order to delegate, very, very simple, very, very easy. You can just go to the delegation list. If you're in your Roy or if you're in data list, it's very similar. You look for the pool that you want to debit that you want to delegate to. Um, here are all of the meld delegation pools. As I mentioned to you, there's 10 of them now and the average as you can see is right around 60 million tokens that have been staked but you just choose which pool that you want to delegate to and you can see how many blocks that they've minted uh, you can also see you know what their average return is although a lot of these are unknown because they're taking again 99 percent of the rewards that you get from their um from their uh, block rewards and they're using them to pay to the community in form of meld tokens so you just go to the delegate, it would process everything for you. And it'll say, you know, do you want to do this? Okay, what do you want to do? And then you can delegate as much, you know, ADA as you want, put in your password, and then boom, you're delegated that pool. So simple, so easy. Once you're delegated, it shows up in here how much you've got delegated. And then Mel keeps track of how long it's been delegated for and awards your tokens accordingly. So very simple to get your ISPO rewards from V7. If you know of any other ones that I've missed, please make a comment down below. Let me know so that I can keep track of who's offering initial stake pool rewards. And I love keeping up with everything going on in the Cardano community. But again, this is one of those unique features that allows people to start earning, start getting into projects, basically as you would an initial public offering with a stock. This allows you to get into initial stake pool offerings as a cryptocurrency. So a great tool, a great way to earn rewards and hopefully be able to grow with as these projects go. If you get 100 rewards that are Mel tokens or MinSwap tokens or X-Ray tokens or Empower tokens, and they start off at a couple of cents and they go up to a couple of dollars, boom, you've got a, a great um, tool for not only helping out the community and helping a project grow, but also to helping your wallet grow over time. So. Thank you for coming out. Thank you for watching everything. Please make sure to give this a thumbs up, share it with friends and people that you think may be interested in initial stake pool offerings or anything that has to do with the Cardano community. I look forward to continuing to grow this and you know, make it better and better every time. So have an amazing rest of your day, whatever you may be doing, and I will see you again on the next one.